This is the Yi Home Camera System. There's three different models, each with different features and price points. Let's check them out. What's up guys, I'm Ben from Authentech. As a quick introduction, these guys at Yi were the same ones to make that new 4K action cam, which I reviewed and it was awesome. So you can check that out here. First, let's start with their original home camera. It has a 720p, 111 degree wide angle lens. Setup on all these cameras is quick and easy. You download their app, connect it to your Wi-Fi network, have the camera scan the QR code, and boom, you're all set up. I will say the app is nice and intuitive. Connecting to the camera feeds is very fast. There's plenty of settings and customization for each camera that I really appreciate. Every once in a while, the app would crash on my S7 Edge, and hopefully with time, these bugs will get squished. The camera also supports two-way communication, digital zoom, and IR night vision. For all the cameras, you can have an SD card recording footage all the time, or only when activity is detected. You can scroll through that timeline to any point, instantly playback footage, or even record those photos or videos to save locally on your phone. All the cameras also support activity alerts, plus you can set specific regions to be alerted, kind of like smart zones. A nice bonus to those activity alerts is when motion's detected, it'll auto upload that video clip just in case that burglar were to steal the camera. Optional cloud storage is coming very soon, as well as monitoring the cameras from your computer. I look forward to those features. Okay, so price for this first one is only 50 bucks. Moving on to home camera two. It has a 1080p, 130 degree wide angle lens, Comparing video footage to the 720 camera, you can clearly see the difference in quality. Also that crazy wide angle of this camera too. Plus it has smart HDR feature that improves the dynamic range. Its price jumps up higher, $130, but that's still cheaper than Nest Cam and you don't have their gouging fees they require on their platform. With the home camera too, it actually packs a lot of bonus features and customization like lens distortion correction, night vision, select your HD quality and bitrate, Gesture recognition, like raise your hand and send messages to your loved ones. I personally found no use for this one. You have human detection for motion alerts. It even has baby crying detection. Overall, the camera quality and features are full-fledged on this camera too. Lastly, they just released the new dome camera, which can rotate and cover a full 360 degrees. The lens itself is 720p, 112 degrees field of view. It also has night vision and two-way audio. The controller for panning and tilting is intuitive. One cool feature is you can set bookmarks of camera positions, so you can either manually jump to those spots quickly or turn on the auto cruise feature, which is awesome, and have it cruise horizontally 360 degrees or cycle through your bookmarks, stopping at each for 10 seconds. Another sweet feature is motion tracking, so when it detects motion, it'll auto follow and track. This is really nice. So price for the new dome camera is $70, sorta of in between cam one and two. Now for my wish list, I have two main items. I'd really like to see support for if this then that and RTSP. If it's because I could integrate these cameras with my other smart home gadgets to create some really cool recipes like if motion's detected on this camera, then flash my life X bulbs red or something like that. RTSP because well, it's a bit nerdy. So if you're interested, I'll explain that down in the description. Okay, so each camera has its own pros and cons, each offered at a different price point. And this is actually nice, so that you can order your perfect custom setup for whatever best suits your needs. I'll give you all those links to check out down in the video description. Huge thanks to Yi for sending me these sample units, and thanks to you guys for watching. Be sure to hit that thumbs up and subscribe button for more tech videos, and until next time, let's live authentic. <laughs>